trip behind the scenes with future country rock blues kings and queens discover them first with palm mash tv palm mash tv It's Paul Mash TV time again. Thank you so much for joining us. We got a great interview coming up shortly. But don't forget about the subscribe and bell buttons and click those, and you'll always be notified of any new episodes coming your way. And if you'd like to leave a comment on the comment section, please feel free to do that. And check out the description uh, part of this interview and also the closing credits at the end of the show because we'll have contact info for you. So stay tuned for that. From Birmingham, Alabama today, we have Rod G. Baby, a very talented artist, obviously. And I think you're really going to love this guy. And we're going to be there in just a minute. But first, here's a quick word from the Caden Gordon Show. So don't go away. We'll be right back right after this. It is Caden from the Caden Gordon Show. Today's best country mix. Check out my show at the thecadengordonshow.com. Okay, we're back, and with us from Birmingham, Alabama, we have Rod G. Baby. Thanks for joining us, Rod. Hey, I appreciate you for having me, man. I appreciate you having me. Uh, yeah, no problem. We're glad to have you here. Um, now, I guess your story is very similar to a lot of people. You probably started when you were a kid. You loved music, and then it went from there, or did it did they have some other kind of story? I mean, we'd love to hear your story about how you found music. Yeah, it, 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 the story kind of starts to say... Uh, um, yeah, I started in church. Mom was big on church. Fell in, fell in love with music right then and just took off from there. Mm. As I got a little older, I, I kind of shut back a little bit. Wanted to play some basketball and, and do other sports and stuff like that. So I kind of put music on the background. I think after, um, I want to say like after high school, but after high school, that's when I kind of picked it back up. Mm. Well, you you got an amazing sound. I know you don't have many years ahead of you, and, and uh, I hope you have good luck there. Uh, oh, yeah. Uh, well, why don't you tell us a little bit about some of the influences that you grew up with that helped influence you? Um, Michael Jackson was my one. He he was my one influence, and then um. Uh, and then I, I got, once I got into the music, you know, I started listening to uh, Chris Brown. I tell everybody, like, I'm a walking Chris Brown. Mm -hmm. um, but as the more I progressed in music, I started listening to country and started listening to um, rock and more R&B and different type of rappers. So it, it was all, it was all gathered together. I, I wouldn't say I got a set person on who inspired me. Um, a lot of people inspire me. Now, now my kids are my big, big inspiration. Well, well, that's good. You know, uh, we all have our, um, you know, influences. You know, you um, you obviously have a wide range of genres, too, you know, which is always good to, excuse me, we have, uh, we do all genres on our show anyway, so that kind of works. Yeah. Um, well, why don't you tell us a little bit about how we can find you? I mean, I'm sure you're on all streaming platforms and and yeah, I'm on I'm on all platforms on um, Spotify, YouTube. You can Shazam me. It's it's I'm on I'm everywhere. If you as long as you I say as long as you type the name in right, you'll find me. Especially mm -hmm. on YouTube, a lot of people get. Oh, excuse me, a lot of people get the YouTube page. Kind of messed up, like they spell it R O D G. They at the baby, and then sometimes I pop up, but sometimes I won't pop up. Mm. But as long as you like spell the name right, um, then you'll find me anywhere. You you basically find me anywhere. Okay, well, uh, go to all the streaming sites, all the social media sites, and uh, you have a website as well, or is it uh, in the? Web? I, we are in the process of making the website. We haven't really got it up yet, but we're in the process of making one. Okay. Uh, well, check him out there. I know he's going to love you for that. And I know you'll love him right back. And um, yeah. 
And uh, we got this uh, song uh, here. Uh, why don't you tell us the title of the song and if there's a story behind it, we'd love to hear it. Uh, broken. Uh-huh. Um, I, me and the, the uh, me and uh, a, a great friend of mine, uh, I actually call him my brother. His name is Jairus Horton. And he called me over one day and was like, you know, hey, let's, let's, get, in, let's get on the mic. I was like, all right. So I, I had gave him the beat. He was the actual one that 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 took the the way of the song. Um, I just came in with my style of how I do my music and how I write, but he actually led the song and was like, "Yo, this would be good for your your fan base." And I was like, "Yeah, you think so?" He was like, "Yeah, this this would be good for your fan base and mine too." So that's how we came about the song, but. Um, the song was actually for how can I put it? Um, I want to say non-religion, but it's 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 for people that's with religion and non-religion. You know, um, a lot of people are scared to say that they're broken. You know, a lot of people are scared to say that they're damaged, um, and don't know which way to go. But like I tell anybody, the First thing you do, you you do is acknowledge that you are broken. And when you acknowledge that you are broken, then you can move the, from those next steps. And so that's what the song is basically saying. It's saying I'm broken. Um, Lord, won't you fix me now? You know, so it, you you asking the Lord to fit, fix your brokenness. That's how we came about it with the song. Um, my mom is a real Christian person. Um, I love the Lord, but Myself, we just have our own different belief on how on how we do things, and this is my one way of um, showing my religion. Hmm. Okay, yeah, that song sounds kind of self-explanatory in a way. So, um, and uh, and I really like it, and everyone out there, I know you're going to love it too. And we're going to get to that in a second. But uh, Rod, we thank you so much for being on the show. We'd love to have you back again sometime if we got anything new to plug for us. Uh, yeah, uh, yeah, I, I'm I'm working on the album now. Um, it should be coming out sometime in February, or March. So yeah, we got to lay back up. Okay, well that sounds good. And here it is, "Broken" by Raji Baby. It begins right now. I'm falling in a deep hole Stuck and I can't get out I got bottles on the table Depression is wearing me down Cause I'm broken Lord, won't you fix me up? Cause I'm broken I just wanna find my way back home I'm taking it step after step and one day at a time I'm trying to find my way And pace my time I'm broken Lord, won't you fix me up? I'm broken Lord, won't you fix me now? I've been running myself crazy And I can't take this no more I've been putting myself through pain My soul on fire trying to stand the rain Feel so apart, so in pieces I don't know what is missing But the pain it hurt so deeply Lord, I want you to come fix it I'm broken Lord, won't you fix me? Fix me. I've been on the hunt trying to find me I've been on them pills trying not to OD Lord, I some people trying to kill me I can't leave my kid before they graduate they Steak and mad potatoes, what they eat, that's on they dinner plate Keep my faith strong and trust in you and you'll help me elevate Never lacking, never slacking, yeah, you always on time You I just walk by faith and side And with you I just, I know I'll make it through I'm falling in a deep hole Stuck and I can't get out I got bottles on the table Depression is Wear me down, cause I'm broken. Lord, won't you fix me up? Cause I'm broken. I just wanna find my way back home. I'm taking it step after step. And 
one day at a time I'm trying to find my way And pace my time I'm broken Lord, won't you fix me up? I'm broken Lord, won't you fix me now?